the Trinity from Quantum Systems stows compactly for storage and transport, but is ready to go in just three minutes without tools, thanks to the Trinity locking mechanism. In this video, we will unpack and assemble the Trinity. Remove the main fuselage from the case and lay it flat on a table or patch of ground that's dry and free from debris, keeping the pitot tube up. Next, attach the rear fuselage to the main fuselage by inserting the black carbon fiber rod into the main fuselage. Be careful to rotate the rear fuselage to keep the bottom aligned so that the top data port fits exactly into the connector on the main fuselage. You'll hear the Trinity locking mechanism click into place when it's fully inserted. Now we'll attach the wings. Pick a wing, either right or left, and attach it next to the motor nacelles on the main fuselage. Keep the blue graphics facing up and make sure to align all three attachment points between the wing and body, two on the main wing and one on the aileron. Repeat this process for the second wing. We're almost done. Attach the elevator to the rear fuselage by lining up the front edge of the connector and pivoting back down until the sliding lock clicks into place. To remove the elevator, make sure you slide the lock forward before trying to lift it off. Finally, let's insert the front nose cone that contains the Trinity's batteries. Be sure to align the connector and then slide the nose cone back until the Trinity locking mechanism clicks into place. This is a secure connection, so it may require a bit of force to lock into place and connect all the power pins. Now you're ready to fly. Thanks so much for watching and be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more great videos from Quantum Systems.